This video will help walk you through how to install a high altitude kit on your WEN generator. A high altitude kit helps keep your generator running as well as possible at high altitudes. The kit consists of a carburetor jet, bolts, and O-rings or gaskets. Check your owner's manual for more information. Each generator has its own kit for different altitude ranges. You can purchase high altitude kits from whenproducts.com. Before beginning, make sure the generator's engine is fully cool. Make sure the engine switch and fuel valve are turned off. Disconnect the spark plug boot. If your generator has a battery, disconnect it. Be careful when working around gasoline and keep sparks and flames away. On some generators, you can replace the jet without removing the carburetor. On others, you have to remove the carburetor. If you have any questions about your specific model, check your owner's manual or contact WEN customer service. Make sure to watch this video fully before beginning work. Step 1. Locate the fuel drain bolt on the bottom of your carburetor. It may look different on different models. Check your owner's manual for instructions on how to drain your carburetor. You'll also need a flathead screwdriver, Phillips head screwdriver, an 8mm and 10mm wrench or socket, a funnel, and something to catch the gas that's drained out. Wipe up any spilled gasoline, then replace or tighten the drain bolts. Step 2. The carburetors look different on different models. Regardless, you'll need to remove the bolt. This is the silver cup at the bottom of the carburetor. Before beginning, note the orientation of the bowl. This will help you reassemble the carburetor later. Also, if your unit has a solenoid valve, make sure to note its orientation too. Step 3. If your unit has a solenoid valve, remove it using the appropriate tools. The bowl is attached with a bolt at the bottom. Remove that bolt, then remove the bowl. Step 4. The main jet may be located inside the stem of the carburetor or on the side, as shown here. Either way, use a flathead screwdriver to unscrew the jet. Remove the old jet and set it aside. Take the new jet and install it using the flathead screwdriver. The jets look the same to the naked eye, so be sure to keep them separate and note which one is which. Step 5. Make sure any O-rings or gaskets are seated properly before reinstalling the bolt or mounting bolt. Don't over tighten any fasteners since this could lead to damage or poor performance. If your carburetor has a solenoid valve on it, replace it in the correct orientation. Once everything is replaced, reinstall the spark plug boot. If you aren't able to replace the jet without removing the carburetor, you may want to check out our handy video on how to replace your generator's carburetor. Or you can always contact one customer service for more assistance. Always follow the instructions and safety warnings laid out in your manual. Thanks for watching! Remember when?